as Ticketmaster cancels its public sale for the singer's upcoming tour. The company says the cancellation comes after extraordinarily high demands and insufficient remaining ticket inventory, among other things. Fallout after the website crashed during the presale has lawmakers questioning the state of competition for the ticketing industry and saying Ticketmaster is abusing its market power. Isabel Rosales has the story. This is the biggest concert of my life! <laughs> Taylor Swift's fans across the country in a state of desperation after the Ticketmaster website appeared to crash during the pre-sale for the singer's upcoming Eras tour. But not all the fans got lucky. Ticketmaster takes the $490 out of my account, but it like crashed. Best believe I'm still bejeweled when I walk in the room. The return of the pop star to the live stage causing turmoil with lawmakers questioning the dominance of Ticketmaster as the country's largest concert promoter. Also arguing that the recent setback for the pop star's fans is only a symptom of a larger problem. Senator Amy Klobuchar in an open letter to Ticketmaster CEO saying she has serious concerns about the company's operations. Congresswoman Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez taking to Twitter saying, daily reminder that Ticketmaster is a monopoly. Its merger with Live Nation should never have been approved and they need to be reined in. Ticketmaster's response, there has been historically unprecedented demand with millions showing up to buy tickets for Swift's tour. Didn't want the ticket prices to be over $20. Complaints about the company's monopoly power go back to 1994 when the rock group Pearl Jam filed a complaint with the Justice Department's antitrust division saying Ticketmaster has a virtually absolute monopoly on the distribution of tickets to concerts. The complaint was later dismissed. Isabel Rosales, ABC7.